Let me know if we're on. Hi everyone, if you're there, we're just uh, checking, checking the system, checking we're on. Dunk Richards here. Great. Guys, today we've got a um, fantastic Guan class. So we're going to be running through Guan life information. Um, we've got lots to cover, of course, as uh, you know, the amazing Guan life range within the Joyco categories from there. So we're just going to give it a couple of minutes. Um, from there, we'll, uh, we'll get started. Waiting for a few people to get on there, guys. Right to go. Cool. Okay. So, guys, firstly, hello, everyone, and welcome. My name's Dunk Richards uh, from Saber Education Experience. So, um, today we've got lots to share with you. Um, so much to do. Blonde's one of the favorite things everybody loves doing in the, in the salon. Um, and of course, the clients love it. So from there, we're going to be sharing with you the range. We're going to be getting into uh, some of the professional products, as well as, of course, the support products that go with it. Um, with that in mind, we'll be um, sharing you know, other hints and tips as we work through each of those products. Please, guys, jump on, send messages through. Um, I've got Abby here with me. She's going to be also sharing messages. So if we don't get to answer them here today, um, we will answer them, you know, later on in the forum from there. So let's hop in. And firstly, I suppose, with the question, um, you know, it's amazing to have all these world-class products that, you know, perform these amazing results. But, you know, why Blonde and what's happening with Blonde? What are people doing out there at the moment? So let's have a little bit of a, a look through some of the categories there. Uh, what are we seeing? We're seeing lots of tonal families of blondes. So for example, here, lots of violets, whether they're that, you know, soft pastel violet or into stronger, you know, more rich lavender tones. We're also seeing silvers, ash, silver, titanium. All of these sort of shades have been really, really popular out there in the marketplace. And from there, of course, working back more into your sandy natural tones that we would work with um, you know more of that really everyday blonde that people are wanting weedy sandy you know really nice sort of lush tones and on top of that of course we will always forever be doing our platinum blondes so uh, platinum is just something that you know whether we're talking Marilyn Monroe, we're talking Lady Gaga, or you know whoever it might be, it's always there. The Kardashians are making it popular. Everyone, um, you know, platinum is always in as far as a blonde goes. So when we look at it from there, let's get into the actual product side of things. Um, working with Blonde Life, guys, we have two category categories as we mentioned when we talk about the whole system. We have the professional category as well as we have support products uh, and categories as well. So we're going to begin with particularly the uh, professional categories of Blonde and what we have in the Blonde Life area from there. Uh, I'm going to start with probably the most popular of the products in the Blonde Life range here, which is of course, Blonde Life Powder. Before we get into Blonde Life Powder, what I'd like to sort of think about is, is really, you know, what do we do when we lighten hair or what happens? Number one, we're removing, you know, natural pigment from the hair. Um, so, you know, we're breaking that hair down when we're actually removing it. So we do tend to therefore make the hair a little bit more fragile. We're also really depleting lipids and oils and different things from the hair. Our hair has a nearly a natural lipid layer which sits on the surface of the hair. And, you know, once we add a lightening product or a chemical product like that, 
it will remove those oils. So we're also, you know, drying that hair out to a point. On top of that, you know, we're weakening slightly that internal structure. Um, and of course, we're going to be losing protein. So this is where our blonde life range really comes into focus. Not only will it give us amazing lift, which is most important, fast, incredible lift. It will give us up to nine levels plus of lift from wherever your starting point is. It will also do that quickly. So when you're looking at the, uh, you know, your salon time in the salon, you want things to happen fast. Blonde Life Powder will do that for you. It works fast. We can use it for on scalp, uh, on scalp or off scalp formulas. We can use it for foil or foil free applications like balayage or ombre looks. So, you know, a lot of freedom with how we work with the product. Most importantly though, when we look inside what's in the product there, we have these key uh, ingredients to repair and, and protect the hair as we're actually lightening. Uh, number one, we have our bond building arginine. So when you're working through from that arginine, one of the most vital amino acids in the hair. Why? It's the first thing that leaves or is broken down when you do a chemical process. So we're really replenishing that back into the hair shaft, nourishing the hair, giving it strength. We also have key oils and you'll, you'll hear these oils a bit as we go through today's presentation. Monoi oil, okay, um, which is a blend or it's a combination of key super oils. It fights, fights frizz, it protects from environmental damage, um, it puts that real, that moisture and natural oil ingredient back onto the surface of the hair, along with our tamanoi oil, which acts as a UV absorber. Um, it really protects, it hydrates the hair, and of course, it bumps up the shine. What happens again once we start to, you know, really break hair down a little bit is we tend to lose shine. So this ensures not only repair, but amazing shine in the hair. So guys, from there, you know what's in it, how do we use it? Okay, Blonde Life Powder, um, number one, can be used for on or off scalp applications quickly and easily. Um, its mixing ratio is a one to one or really may vary up to one to two mixing ratio. So from there, when we're using it on scalp, we can use it with 10 volume developer or 20 volume developer. Okay, or three or six percent, whatever you like to sort of work through from there. Uh, we do not use it with 30 volume or 40 volume guys for on scalp application. And processing time is 60 minutes and we don't use heat. Um, working with this product, you will find it's sufficiently fast enough. We don't want to put it under the heat and actually be drying it out. Ingredients in this product keep it nice and moist while it's on the hair shaft. So that's a really important point. For off-scalp application, guys, mixing instructions remain exactly the same. One to one or up to one to two mixing ratio. But you can use it with either 10, 20, 30, or up to 40 volume developer for off-scalp application. Working through you, I think you will generally find it's very rarely you ever need to go beyond a 20 volume application. So, you know, that's where you'll find the beauty, the integrity of the hair remains you will always love using it that way. So guys, little tip number one today for our Blonde Life Powder. When we're working with it, uh, the thicker the mix, so if you like your mixture to be one-to-one, -one, a little bit thicker consistency, so it's a bit more grabby when you're doing your application through there, really adhering a little bit more strongly, um, the thicker the mix, the faster your lightener will lift. If you like it a little bit creamier and you lift, mix it one to two parts peroxide, then you will find it will give you a bit more control. It won't lift quite as quickly. Uh, so therefore, keep that in mind when you're mixing, find a consistency that you like, and then you'll always know your lifting ability and how quickly it will work. Little tip number two as well, and this will be for both of our, our lightning products here. When we're mixing our lightener, okay, we put our lightener in, then we put our developer in, okay, when we're mixing, don't get in and really mix and mix and mix and mix really quickly. In doing that, okay, you're adding more oxygen to your formula. Um, what that will actually do will be, it can tend to expand your lightener uh, so it won't work as well, okay? It will dry out more quickly. The oxygen you need, guys, comes with your developer. So, of course, 
when you're using your lightener, um, mix slowly if you're using a whisk and fold the product, or if you're using a brush, again, fold your product nice and gently from there. So little couple of tips to work with, with both our lightning products. Guys, for anybody who's just joined, I will just mention we're covering our Blonde Life range here, professional and care. Feel free to be adding in any comments or giving us, shooting us through any questions as you'd like as we go along now. Okay, into our Blonde Life cream. Now, the beauty of working here with our Blonde Life cream, this is really that partner to, of course, our Blonde Life powder. Now working through with our Blonde Life Cream, once again, the beauty is this is a nine levels of lift. Um, when we're working with a cream, the key thing is that um, being a cream, the consistency is a little bit smoother to work with. Creams are also a little bit more, a little bit healthier on the hair or on the scalp. So if your absolute priority, priority for the client you have in your chair is ensuring 100% condition is maximum. This is your, your, your number one priority from there. Um, working through, this is a great product, guys. I love it if you're doing foil-free techniques. So if you're doing, you know, balayage or freehand techniques, uh, the, the Blonde Life Cream is perfect for that scenario. Really lovely consistency to work with. Um, again, when we look at those key ingredients, not only is it in a cream, but it particularly contains those key three ingredients, the arginine, a mono oil, and a tamanu oil as well. So keep that in mind when you're working through here. Mixation for the Blonde Life Cream is again, one-to-one, -one, or you may vary it up to one-to-two. Same rules will apply as we talked about with our Blonde Life Powder. So the, the thinner the consistency, the more control you will have, the slightly slower it will lift. Once again, no heat in our mixation from there. Um, if we're working it for on scalp, once again, 10 or 20 volume peroxide when we're using it on scalp. For off scalp applications, of course, from there, we can vary through from 10 volume right through to 40 volume once again. But these products do lift quickly, guys. Keep your eye on them from there as you're working through with it. Now, I will also point out our post removal service, which is the same for both products here. Rinse these out really well when you're rinsing them and then with shampoo with our Blonde Life Brightening Shampoo. Rinse really well and then follow up with our Blonde Life uh, Brightening Mask. Um, leave that in guys for five minutes, okay? Prior to rinsing and following with your, your previous or your other Blonde Life Care products. That would vary if we have used Defy Damage as our uh, pre-lightening process, which we do recommend for every lightening and chemical service. If you do use your Defy Damage guys, of course, follow up with that Defy Damage um, Pro Series 2 when we're actually rinsing out shampoo and Pro Series 2. So that is that one area you will vary. Sometimes you will find guys, the cream particularly is really enriched with those oils. So from there, if you feel that you're, um, you know, you need to really give it a really good wash through um, to remove those oils, and sometimes you do, don't be scared to leave your shampoo on for a few minutes or even use a deep cleansing shampoo. You're clarifying if that's required from there. Um, tip for our Blonde Life cream is going to be, guys, when you're working through, particularly if you're doing a color intensity, um, you will often find that the Blonde Life powder will give you a little bit more um, porosity on the hair. So if you're going to be doing immediately after that lightening process, a color intensity application, it's great to also go with the Blonde Life powder to work with there. Okay, moving on to our next lightening um, category from there. Guys, I will just point this out to you. This is a little chart we have, and it just gives you a quick um, snap guide of what each of the lighteners use. So if you're not sure which one to go to, you can flick directly to this and it will give you some key points. Uh, what it's ideal for, for example, what its key applications would be on off scalp, freehand application, for example, what its lifting power is. Uh, Blonde Life Cream and Blonde Life Powder are our two highest lifting powders. So they're both nine plus levels, guys. Um, from there, when we work through, 
at uh, what base it is. So one is of course a white cream, the other is a uh, is a slightly a cool blue powder. I would say it's really like more of a a, um, a very much a powder blue, a very very light powder blue. Um, both are fast, okay, in their lifting ability, both on and off scalp. It will run through that tech information for you and the difference. So a really good quick snapshot if you're looking at which product to use there. Okay, so guys, now into our Blonde Life Hyper High Lift Permanent Cream Colors. So Hyper High Lift. Um, what are they doing? Again, they're the extreme. Like Blonde Life uh, Lighteners, these give you extra lift. They give us five levels of lift on natural hair. Unlike a, uh, a powder or a cream lightener, um, they can't be used to lift artificially colored hair. So they are designed specifically to be working on natural virgin hair for giving us maximum lift. Um, so when you're using these, um, you really hyper high lifts are, are like a bridge between normal color and bleach. They will do a combination of two things, five levels of lift, as well as like a color does, give us deposit of an artificial tone in the hair to counteract any warmth that we're working on in the hair. So our hyper high lift guys um, come in three tones. There's a shampoo, a champagne, a pearl, and a clear booster. Um, and we can see here on the chart here, this gives you a, a quick snapshot guide of champagne, pearl, and clear booster on of course 100% white hair. But what we've also done here, the clever kids at Joyco have given you a shade result if you were using these shades on a level seven or on a level five. So immediately you can see what type of result you will get, you know, if you're working on a normal textured hair, level five or level seven. So it's a great guide from there. Always take into consideration elasticity, porosity, density, um, each of those things when we are making our color selection. With each of the Blonde Life um, shades here in the Hyper High Lift guys, they are intermixable. So from there, when we're working with these, you can use the champagne and pearl and mix them together, or you can add the clear, blue, clear booster. In adding clear booster, that will actually help you dilute the tonal quality um, of the champagne or the pearl that you're mixing them with. So again, what's inside when we look at these? What's in that technology? We know they lift five levels. Um, so they lift one level lighter than, for example, a normal high lift or extra lift series. From there, they have all those beautiful nourishing ingredients such as our arginine, von Bidding arginine, our argiplex technology, again, to reduce any breakage in the hair, increase shine in the hair. Um, along with that, they have quadramine complex to add protein and strengthen further and our man manoe and our tamanu oils. So all of that jam packed into one tube of color that's giving us five levels of lift and also deposit of color um, from a level five natural base. So how do we use them? Mixing, working with our hyper high lift are a one to two mixing ratio. Now, if we're working on scalp guys, we can use them with 20, 30 or 40 volume developer for maximum lift. Um, when we're working with these, particularly if you're using them off scalp, you would definitely wanna be using at least 30 or 40 volume. Of course, the higher the volume, the more lift you will achieve. If you work back down with, for example, a 20 volume, your lift will be really limited to two to three levels of lift. So keep that in mind. When we're removing the product from the house, we would of course rinse thoroughly. And again, we would follow up using our Blonde Life Brightening Shampoo um, and also our Blonde Life Brightening Mask, which would be left in for five minutes. So guys, keep that in mind when you're working with the, the Blonde Life Hyper High Lifts. A few little tips down the bottom. Of course, they're not designed for previously bleached or highlighted and colored hair. Um, also for hair that has 30% gray. While these have a lot of lift, they have a lot of deposit and it would tend to really grab and go really, you know, off tone on those, uh, that gray hair. So keep them away from there. Okay. And of course, keep your porosity and elasticity in mind 
We don't, they're not designed for relaxed or perm tear. So just keep that in mind, guys. Okay, I'm going to move on to um, our, our new Blonde Life, our quick toners here. These have been a revelation. I might just check before we move on though. Um, any questions? We're all good, guys. Okay, cool. We're going to keep moving through. So here, guys, we have our Blonde Life Quick Toners, um, and these are a liquid cream. So they're really unique in how we actually utilize these products. Uh, when we're working through, uh, they come through, well, we'll come in four separate shades, silver, violet, sand, and clear. So number one, why would we like them? Um, I think everyone, you know, when we can get something that allows us to do something a little bit faster, a little bit quicker and makes it uh, more efficient for us in the salon, while improving our results, it's a winner for us all. So when we're working with these toners, that's exactly what they do. Your client walks in uh, or you're pre-lightened, there's a little bit of that yellow tone still left in the hair from where you've pre-lightened to. Within you know three to five minutes, we can have that gone, knocked out straight away. So it's really, really great and quick to use in the salon. Um, five minutes or less. When we're working through with them, each of these tones can also be intermixed. So guys, if you're working with you know, a silver and you wanna add a little bit of violet um, or vice versa, depending on how much warmth you have left in the hair, or you wanna soften it down and add some sand, you can do that. If you wanna dilute it so you feel, I don't want too much tone, you can always add clear into your mixture. So working through with the Blonde Life um, quick toners, Key thing, of course, is five minutes. Application being a liquid cream is really, really simple. Um, because of that consistency, they really flow through the hair really, really easily. So nice and easy to work with. Um, you can see here, guys, we've got on our page some key points through here as well. Uh, this is giving us a, uh, a breakdown. If we look at, for example, silver toner, um, service it will give us, it's for cool silver blonde tonal results. Um, and it features a silver base, it's a true silver. So if you wanted to get that type of silvery gray in the hair, that's perfect. Now, the longer you leave it on, will determine also how much tone you actually provide in the hair. So um, working through from that processing time, you can see we go from more of a pastel silver through to quite a, a stronger ashy type silver tone in the hair. And that will work the same when we're working with the violet or the sand. A slightly softer tone, neutralizing. Now, if you want to leave, you can leave these on longer and you can achieve more fashion tone results. So tip with that with the quick toners is if you want to achieve fashion toner results, pre-lighten up, you're going to want to get to at least level nine or 10, um, but then you can actually achieve a fashion toner result. Apply on, leave them on a little bit longer, you will get more of a true violet tone or a silver tone or a sand tone, for example. Um, and I love these little, it's like a before and after these little half heads. You can see what's been done when we've worked through pre-toning the hair and doing half head toners on each of the, uh, the lovely ladies below here. So a great little example for us. So how do we use them, okay? Um, number one, when we're working through, these are really simple to use, guys. Um, firstly, when we're toning, we will generally always be toning on um, towel dried or damp hair. Now, of course, you can always use working with it. You can always be using your Defy Damage as um, pre-toning and that will again improve your length longevity, improve how long it's kept on the hair. On top of that, we also um, have the opportunity if you're not using, for example, your um, Defy Damage, you may have used it in your, your lightening process, you could also use HKP. We would always recommend HKP again prior to any color service if we're not using Defy Damage. So a light mist through. Directions as far as mixing with our quick toners, okay, is a one-to-one -one mix. Um, so with that, guys, one-to-one -one mix, 
and we mix them with our five volume LumaShine developer. So working with that, um, you can apply it in bowl and brush or bottle application if you prefer whatever works, depending on how quickly or if you need to do sort of spot applications and you need to use a bowl and brush, that's fine. So work with it how you need to. Process, five minutes. Five minutes and we'll be done from there. Now, of course, post-process, of course, guys, as we work through from there, um, rinse really well, of course. Um, and then we would use our Blonde Life Brightening Shampoo and follow up with our Blonde Life um, Mask to finish off for five minutes before moving on to our, our other key Blonde Life stylers or finishing products from there. One variation again would be if we're using our Defy Damage series. Again, guys, of course, please finish with your Defy Damage if that's the case. So guys, that really gives us a little wrap up on each of the, um, the professional products within our Blonde Life category there. So now I'd really like to just give you a nice quick snapshot of the support products that really come to assisting us when maintaining those beautiful blonde results at home for our clients. So working through with each of these, um, these products, one of the key things I think when we're working or looking at, at really blondes is, is again, keeping the shine on the hair as well as the condition. Um, so one of the key things when we look at each of the, the Blonde Life range, as we have natural detoxifiers within this range. So with that, they neutralize out chlorine, they remove trace minerals from the hair, keeping your blondes bright, perfectly on tone in between color touch-ups. So that's an absolutely little piece of gold when you're working with these. That's what, one of the things that makes this whole support range so amazing. So let's have a look at it. Technology, okay, is a smart release technology, which is a, a combination of three, three key ingredients. Arginine, the most important amino acids that's removed from hair during a chemical or, or when hair is damaged. Monoi oil, tamanu oil. Now with each of these, um, not only do we have uh, our, our arginine, we also have a keratin in there. Um, so with each of these things, it's like a, a little power packed little capsule that will enter the hair shaft when the hair is being washed, treated, conditioned, and will basically release itself within the hair. So from there, it does that on its, as it's needed. So you're getting this constant replenishment of moisture and protein while you are continuing to use any of our Blonde Life range. So looking at each of the individual products, uh, guys, of course, we have our Blonde Life shampoo, our brightening shampoo. Um, now with this, one of the key things, it's got a lovely rich lather to it. So when we're working with it, your client will love it. The hair will feel really beautiful and clean when they're working with it. It is free of SLS and SLES sulfates. Um, but keep in mind, as I say, you still get that beautiful, clean, crisp sort of feeling to your bright blondes. It'll give you that lovely, rich lather. Of course, guys, when we work through, um, we would apply to wet hair, really work into a rich lather and rinse, repeat if necessary. Um, now, if you're working with hair that's maybe highly toned, you might just wanna give it one shampoo. If you're wanting to really cleanse, you can of course follow up with a second shampoo. For your daily uh, use, you would of course then guys come back to your Blonde Life Brightening Conditioner. So this would be your regular daily use. Um, for clients, you know, we're working with bleach blonde. We want to get lots of rich nourishment and conditioning into that hair, um, but we want to still keep that hair really nice and light. Lighten its feel, lighten its shine and, and appearance. So as we're looking to it from there, guys, this will give us lots of that rich moisture to the hair and elasticity on a daily basis. Now, when I say daily basis, if you wash your hair three times a week or four times, this is more your regular shampoo or, and conditioner use. Um, you don't have to be washing your hair every day. Uh, when we're working through with it here, guys, we would of course apply on after our shampoo has been rinsed and then we just leave it on for two minutes. Always comb it through, always sort of work that through, give it a comb through and leave that two minutes for maximum moisturizing benefits. 
but that extra really dose of richness and treatment and intensity then we'll actually go to our blonde life brightening mask and i and i love that it's called a mask it really has that real rich lush mask feel to it um, so working through as it mentions here um, it amps up the pale strands by neutralizing any trace minerals in the hair um, so you don't get that dullness that yellowing it's also not heavy or greasy as i say it's a really nice sort of fresh mask that we would be working with here so for clients, um, and particularly most clients that are blonde, you know, we realize guys, they're usually bleached. So we do need to be replenishing them, with, replenishing them with treatments. So this would be something you would want to do generally maybe once or twice a week, depending on how regularly you wash your hair. Uh, with that, a blonde life brightening mask would be applied and left on the hair for three to five minutes. Same as all our Joico treatment systems. And when we're doing that, leave on once again, combing through. Once you, you rinse off, you'll have again that beautiful, lovely, fresh, but the hair has amazing elasticity and shine and beautifully bright and blonde. To follow up there, guys, we now move into some of the, the leave-in products. And this is our brightening veil. Um, our brightening veil really as a thermal styler. So number one, when we're working through you would apply this after number one when the hair is towel dried it can also be applied to do to dry hair but it will protect from uv exposure it'll protect against humidity which blondes tend to want to absorb lots of humidity and tend, can tend to go a bit frizzy so this will really stop that fly away that frizziness um, and tend to stop that hair from going more into an anti-static sort of format um, it really gives us an extra layer of protection to make sure you've got your hair remains moisturized, frizz free and with lots of shines and it is super, super light. So when you apply this on, you actually can, as I say, apply it in the hair damp. Tip for this one, guys, I love when I've just about finished blow drying this, drying a client's hair give it another really light mist through the mid length to ends of the hair and then hit it again with the blow dryer. It just completely eliminates any little frizziness or fly away pieces of hair. So it's a really great one to work with. Um, again, will add great elasticity and shine for you. And of course, for that extra dose of absolute super gloss on blondes, again, which blondes don't want to be nice and bright, um, from there, we've got our Blonde Life Brilliant Glow Brightening Oil. Um, now, our brightening oil is applied and it gives that, that crystal clear shine on blondes, just that lovely gloss, super, super light on the hair. And it's something you can feel it when you put it in the hands, you only need one or two, two pumps into your hand, really break it up onto your hands, really work it over and then work it through that hair. Not only will it make the hair extremely shiny, um, it'll really magnify your blonde. So, you know, they won't look pale, they'll look bright and rich as you're working through. It, it really magnifies the shine and the gloss of whatever tone you're working with. So from there, anything from honey tones to sandy to silver, you know, you can work through with this Blonde Life Brilliant Glow Brightening Oil. Um, as I mentioned here, you can work through damp hair or just really nice and light handed, you can apply it also on dry hair just to really refresh that, that shine as well and really pump it up a little bit. Okay, so there are general support products, but if you're after that maintenance of stopping that client, you want from, uh, you don't want somebody going yellow or off tone and you wanna keep that ultra cool violet or neutral tone in the hair, here's where we have our Blonde Life um, violet life violet range. So this is a new neutralizing blonde life range to get rid of any yellow um, or unwanted warm brassy tones in the hair. Of course, guys, it's really packed with all of our rich nutrients such as our smart release technology, our arginine, our monoi oil and our tamanu oil. So each of those, we haven't left anything out in this. This is all in there along with this really rich violet tone that will really neutralize any of that cool, that, sorry, warm yellow or brassy tones. So to start with guys, 
we would work with, we have our shampoo. You can see with the Blonde Life Violet shampoo, you can see in the picture how rich that violet tone is. So when we're utilizing this, uh, this tone, it will banish out any of the yellow. That's number one priority. It is also SLS and SLES sulfate free. Be aware of that too. So a great tip for working with your blondes. It will really keep and maintain that tone. Now, tip with this one, of course, is apply it into wet hair. The longer we leave it in the hair, the more tone it will neutralize. So for example, I can apply this on, lather it through, and I could leave it on for you know maybe one minute. And it will give me a nice sort of soft toning on the hair. If I feel that my client has you know, a little bit more warmth, I'm trying to quickly instantly neutralize, I can leave it on up to three minutes. I can also repeat that process. So I could actually do that you know, two or three times if I want to actually add more violet tone or correct more yellow in the hair. So number one, you know, evaluate the hair, even do a test strand if you feel you need to when you're working with it. The key is to follow up with your Blonde Life Violet Conditioner. Of course, when we look at it and, and, uh, and look at our tone in our Violet Conditioner here, you'll see it looks, looks a little bit more pastel in its, um, its Violet Tone. But because it's in a conditioner, you're leaving a little bit more of residual tone on the hair. So what this does is gives you instant, bright and cool blonde hair. Um, and working with it, it will also ensure that it really, again, helps maintain the violet that you've used in your shampoo, as well as the extra you're adding in in your conditioner. So it's important to use them as a one-two shot, okay? Keep those as a... Um, as a, as a duo when you're working with them, use them together. You may not need it to be using this every day, guys. Evaluate your clients. Some clients might need to use it once a week, some maybe twice a week, some maybe once a fortnight. Um, so it's really evaluate your client, see how frequently you, they need to be utilizing it from there. But once you've used those two, you've then got, of course, your Blonde Life Violet, your Toning Violet Smoothing Foam. Um, so this acts as an extra smoothing or an extra violet dose for the hair. Um, and the great thing about working with this is the beautiful smoothing properties that it has. So if you're working with this, while we say it's a smoothing foam, I can use it to kill the warmth in the hair. I can also use it to blow dry that hair beautifully and smooth, or I could actually use it to smooth out the frizziness on curly hair as well, and just leave it in the hair, but using it more for its violet tone. Because I'm using it in and I'm leaving it in, again, we're getting a, a real topical and residual application of our violet. So it's brilliant in how it will help control, control and keep that beautiful neutral or violet tone you want in the hair. Um, this is a really rich, beautiful mousse, guys. So when you're working with it, you'll notice you'll put it into your hand. It will stay on your, on your hand there and it will act and feel. You'll feel that creamy richness of it. It won't disappear and dissolve away. So when you're working with this, you can apply it really and, and focus on key areas that you need to. Um, Frizz-free, violet tone, beautiful shine. Okay, it's got everything you want as well as an amazing fragrance. The important thing when you're using it, guys, it has that whippy sort of look to it. So when you're working with it, really shake it very well. Uh, turn the can upside down when you're working with it and, and squeeze it out into your palm and then apply it through. You can be quite liberal when you work it through. It's a really, really lightweight feel. So it won't have a, a strong hold or anything there. So it'll just give you a lovely control. Um, so guys, that really wraps up our Blonde Life Professional and Blonde Life Support products. Um, so from there, um, guys, any questions, please feel free to, to reach out, um, share us some information, share us some questions on our Sabre Education Experience Facebook page. We can't wait to see some of your work. So if you've got some great before and afters that you've done, um, you've just done a great client in the salon, um, please take a picture and share it on our Saver page there um, so as others can learn, learn from your formulas, your experiences that you're having with our amazing Saver, Saver brand products. Guys, um, look forward to seeing you again soon. Thank you for today and hope to see you all again soon. Keep out. We've got lots more coming up on the experience. We'll be sending you more information out.
Thanks, guys.